This RC jet can drop real missiles, I'm not kidding. But in order to create this engineering masterpiece, we're going to need to solve a couple issues. First, we need to design a system that is lightweight and easy to install because of course, if the system is too heavy, the plane will stall and hit a tree. So to avoid that, I think the best bet is to use 3D print PLA. The design we have in mind is really simple. We'll have a holder that you place the missile in with a pin that gets pulled by a servo that releases the missile on either side of the wing. So we designed the parts in Tinkercad and printed them out. After installing them on the jet, this is what we had, and so far it seemed promising. We also printed out some missiles and shoved batteries in them to add some weight. Now it's time to go for a test flight. First, we did a flight without the missiles to see if everything was running smoothly. Yeah, land probably yes. Like sooner, right? Than later. Yeah. Bring it in. And of course, we buttered the landing. Oh, yeah, that's pretty good. Oh, no. Oh. <coughs> that was a little bit. <laughs> no. So after a quick repair, we tested the missiles. Yay. Nice. And took off yet again. Is it like low power? Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> oh, gears are retracted. Yeah, yeah, I retracted them. Wait, so we can literally. Fine. Yeah, we can hit another yeah. flight then. Yeah, but we gotta figure out the issue. First. Well, I think battery was just low. Yeah, I dropped the I dropped the bombs. I'm like, <laughs> no, nice. Dude, it could actually be just too much weight. Since we didn't know what the issue exactly was, we changed the batteries and sent it again without the bombs. Remember, slow takeoff. Oh, God. It's flying? Yes. Yeah, we're good. I right, got some height. Got some yeah. height. This time, the plane had no issues and flew flawlessly. Holy shit. Hey, turn, you can turn off engine, David. <gasps> Yay! Oh, shit, okay. <laughs> so, the next day, we went to the field for the last time. We plugged everything in, and it was now or never. Yeah, we're going against the wind. Okay, we're literally ready to take off. <laughs> Oh, what a takeoff. Oh my god. Honestly, you can barely carry it. Yeah, it looks like, like really that. heavy. That's why I dropped it. Yeah, whatever, we got the angle on the plane though. Oh, yeah, we got the drop angle. Okay, now let's just bring it in so the camera doesn't explode so we get the footage. Dude, it's yeah, I'll take your time with the comment. Yeah. Like, you got time. I'll see, I'll do a couple of flies. Actually, now let's just try bringing it in right away. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna. Are you gonna come in from that side? Yeah. Okay, I got it. I'll take, I'll take it nice and far. Hey, I need to go down. I'm like shaking my ass off. Yeah, I can. Oh, whatever. You gotta turn off the engine and glide it then, dude. Oh, nice. Hopefully. Not oh. Bad. Oh, I hit the gas. Whatever, we got it down. We got it down. Okay, the bombs are like quite a load. Wait, one is like in the ground right now. Okay, that missile's deep. <laughs> Oh, that, wait, that's wait, that's strong. jammed in there. Oh, wait, that's like jammed. Wait, I mean, this one broke his yeah. tip. Oh, wait, the battery flew up. These missiles were absolutely deadly, but what I didn't mention in this video is that this whole plane and system were just tiny prototypes for a huge oncoming project. So subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Here comes trouble, putting on a show, like a domino, I fall, another bottle, don't know what to say. Send me on my way to you